Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Imperion Galactic Survival. I am Zaystars, and we are playing Star Salvage. Now, we've warped to Nomastera, Nom, Nom, Nomspera. Yeah, I don't have night vision on. That's just a super green planet. Now, I decided to come to this planet because we have a restroom and... Oh, this one's... The moon's got a restroom in Zescosium, but the planet's got a restroom on it, so I kind of want to go down... And see if we can't drop one of these billions of auto miner cores, actually. I wonder how we're doing with that. I want to drop an auto miner down. Because we'll be able to get some arrestroom that way. Where are the auto miners? I know I unlocked them. Didn't I? Oh, this is the wrong constructor. Can't make auto you can't make auto miners in a small constructor. Silly me. Alright. So we can't... We need some more Zescosium alloy. Which is part of my motivation for building one tier one auto miner. Alright, let's uh... Let's do this. What are we looking at on this planet? I see Xerax. I see Creel. It's a big damn planet. I don't see... Any... Resource nodes with this first scan. Now, I think the Creel are not happy with us. That's kind of the general the general feeling that the Creel have, is being not happy. I'm also very curious as to what these wrecks are. So, I'm going to fly around a little bit, since there appears to be absolutely nothing near me. Yeah, we'll fly this way and see what these Xerox POIs are. So, we want to go west. So, that's... nope, sorry. I guess I could go that way, too. Why does it show... Oh. It was the Creel off to my left. Huh. So they're not showing up on here, but they're showing up here. Off to my southwest. It shows Creel down here, but I don't see them on the map. That's interesting. That is very interesting. All right. Well, I guess it's uh, scoping out the region time, and then once I locate... Oh. Wait a minute. I'm flying backwards. <laughs> Did I build my capital vessel backwards? Hold on. Hold the phone. <laughs> no. No, I couldn't have. I couldn't have. <laughs> oh my god. I built my capital vessel backwards. <laughs> now, how wait a minute. No, that can't be because it wouldn't... Yeah, my forward thrust. Because if I check statistics... No, I've got the exact same on the front as I do on the back. 155 meganewtons. No, this says I only have 78... 192 meganewtons. Is that because I turned that thruster off? Yeah. <laughs> Or maybe I didn't build it backwards. Maybe the template, because because I built this off of a template, which means the template was backwards. Because I'm definitely not facing west right now. I'm facing east. Oh my goodness gracious! Uh, I've replaced the core several times because I kept moving it around. I don't think there's anything I can do about it. You guys let me know if there's anything I can do about this. Because <laughs> that's insanity. I'm, it says I'm, I'm pointing west. I'm flying east. I don't remember this being a problem on the old planet. Oh my god, this is so weird. Okay. 
I don't know, maybe it was and I just didn't pay attention? What about north and south? Okay, I'm heading south, then I'm traveling north. Was this an issue on the on the old, old planet? I don't remember. <laughs> oh, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Huh. That is something else. Well, regardless, I am going to be traveling, like, backwards for a while, I guess. As weird as that is. So, I hope you guys enjoy me flying backwards and having the compass directions reversed, because that's life now. If there is a way to fix it, please comment in the comment section let me know. Oh, look, I bet you that's a restroom right there. Um, I'd really like to fix it. I, I really would. <laughs> Okay, so we are definitely hostile with the Creel. I have bases turned off of my turrets, so we can come down here. Insula, there we go. Now we should discover the Creel. There we go. It didn't attack me. Maybe we're out of range. Okay, I want to go there. Ooh, and then we'll get on the motorcycle and head over to that. That is a quote-unquote interesting POI. Okay, so we've got, what are we looking at? Negative 12 degrees, 8.5 radiation. I mean, that's high, but it's not undoable. Am I still in this silly spacesuit? Yeah, we better go take it out. And then we'll grab an auto miner. So we're at this Erestrum auto miner. I don't know if I want, actually, I didn't look at the gravity on this planet. That's fine. Excuse me, um, we want, where did I put it, in here? Yeah, I know, doing these little auto miners is terrible, but it's what we got right now. Where, oh, what's that? An egg, huh? Uh, where'd it go? A blong, oh man, I didn't reset the, that's annoying, there it is. I'll get those off the screen here in a minute. A restroom. Okay. Oh, we've got the wrong mission. Okay, so let's go to the engineering mission. Rank six. Yeah, yeah, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Oh, that's craft auto miners. Zero out of five. Oh, man. I got all excited. Okay. That means I crafted an auto miner without having without having this mission active. Which is trash. Because I don't have the arrestrum. I don't have the arrestrum to uh fix it. To build a tier three, which is what I really want. I'd really rather not build any more tier ones, because I only have seven auto miner cores. Which I guess that's plenty, screw it. So we also ran up on the ghost ship and got a whole bunch of junk. Oh, those I don't care about. Those I don't care about. We got some ammunition. We got some oxygen. We got some ectoplasm, which just... You just get the ectoplasm out of the fuel tanks. Although, I did forget to grab the fuel tanks. They might have been an interesting thing to grab. Okay, so there's one auto... Oh, you know what? It wants... One out of five auto miners. It wants. I have to craft all five auto miners. I think before placing. Now that I think about it, so I'm not going to do that. I've changed my mind. I'm. Oops, I'm going to attempt to find some Zascosium in a restroom, and maybe we'll go. No. Plasma drones. Here, let's pick these plasma drones up. Okay, we got some fuel, and some, it looks like plasma shot. What are these glowing mushrooms? Oh, they're mushrooms. <laughs> okay. Take it. Yeah. Probably grab some of these, too. I wonder if there's any pentaxid floating around this planet. I don't know. What's this? That doesn't look like a rock. Ooh, confetti moss. Very nice. 
Yeah, one nice thing about the alien planets is they have tons of resources. Am I being followed? I am being followed. They also have tons of critters. Okay, so instead of the auto miner thing, because I want Zeskosium, if I'm going to make an auto miner and use a core, I want it to be at tier 3. There's absolutely zero reason to do a smaller auto miner. Where did I put the fridge? There it is. Zero reason. Ethium. Yeah. Okay. Sweet. Zero. So let's go over to that. Uh, what? What do they call it? An interesting POI. I got to make sure we don't. Here we go. We got to make sure we don't uh, belong next to it because I think we need to do it with the motorcycle. So let's go back in here. And we can take a look at the exploration story mission. I think that's the one I picked, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay, we've landed. Let's throw... Wait, where's that motorcycle? Um, here? Uh-huh. Uh -huh. uh -huh. All right, uh, let's go downstairs. We need to fill up our food, and we need... Do I have a radiation booster? Nope, armor and weapons. Armor, armor, here we go. Ah, I do. Let's put a radiation booster on instead of... Hmm, the mobility booster. That'll kick us up to 12 radiation protection, which will keep us protected here. All right, now, there are a ton of critters about, like that one, that we need to be cognizant of. So let's do this. I don't know if we can even draw... Holy crap, this thing is responsive. Oh. Sigma outpost. Okay. Look at an interesting POI. So this didn't... It didn't give me credit for it. So it must not be this POI that's interesting. I mean, Sigma, Sigma outpost is interesting. Three colonists. Three colonists are good. Okay, let's take a look real quick. Before we do that, let's get up here. So we don't get surprised by some predator. Come on. Come on. Yeah, you see him running around? We don't need those guys. Legacy. We don't need those idiots attacking me while I'm while I'm in the PDA. Use your motorbike. Locate an interesting POI. No, POIs that are part of a mission are often represented by a chevron instead of a typical POI indicator on the map. So it's possible I'm screwed. Because I didn't go up to one of these mission POIs with this active. I don't know. I mean, I might have to go back to the main but the main area for that. Um, combat. Combat with space drones. Engineering was that one. I could do the advanced. Just get the advanced training out of the way. And uh, have medical too. Okay, where'd my ship go? There it is. Is that guy still over here, or did he bugger off? Did he actually leave? That's crazy. Alright, let's get back to the ship. Big map post is quite a thing. Looks like there is a lot of holes on the ground. Okay. Utilities room currently bypassed due to dangerous robot. Do not flip the switch. There's no dangerous robots. Ow! Ow! There's no dangerous robots. Pew 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 pew. 
I think I might have been uh, far more entertained by that than I should have been. Hopefully I don't run into the problem of screwing up my relationship with these guys, but I'm curious. Come on, baby. Can I kill you? Did I screw up my relationship? I don't think so. Oops, I reloaded well. Oh, Jesus, there's more. Okay, so it looks like they probably just keep coming. So we'll just leave that alone. I don't want to take the chance of damaging my relationship with these guys. So how the hell do I get to their upper platform? Oh, not like that. Hey, robot. Oh, I wonder if... If I access it, run through and flip that other switch, if that will get it fixed. You know, and shut off the, the robots. And then we go... Flip! Nope, there's code. There's code! Okay, so that's not it. Oh, you know what? I wonder, was there a code that I just didn't see? Okay, quick review of the thing. There is a code. We go boom, 1775. Emergency shut down. I'm glad the robots can't seem to understand this text. Say la vie, suckers. Still can't get in there, but it was entertaining. Did I kill both of these? Oh, loot, I mean, yes. Okay, sweet. <laughs> that was dumb. <laughs> Who's this guy? What's this guy doing? Oh shit, what the f- What just blew up? <gasps> Sigma Outpost is no longer owned by the Colonials. They don't hate me, do they? They don't. But that effectively just gave me an opportunity to have a base on this planet. And to loot everything. Because it's not Colonial anymore. I need to have a loot box. I think that needs to be one of the next things that I build. A box just for loot. Make it mm, 128k. You know? It doesn't have to be huge. And then that'll be for loot only. But I want to get in. Oh, I bet the inn is over there. Oh yeah, because there's a, there's a landing platform. It makes perfect sense that's where the inn would be. I mean, I'm not going to make this a home. I, just because I don't want to live on an alien planet. But. Oxygen. And the out. But I will certainly loot the crap out of it. What the? Oh. Okay. So we got some solar panels, which are useless on this planet. Now I know, though, if I see one of these Sigma outposts on a different planet, I can... Kill the core pretty easily. And eat their food. Huh. Oh, oh yeah, I need a shower. That is totally not the shower. Sorry, ladies and gentlemen, nobody wanted to see that. Oh, these are neat little quarters. I will take your food. Oh, and your radiation boost. Hells, yeah. Okay. Okay. Should have worn my light armor. Um, that's the way we came from. This is a neat little area over here. And each of these little pods is their own little area. Oh, this is like a little mezzanine. Oh, it's got a pool. <laughs> this place has a pool. Oh, goodness gracious, great balls of fire. Is there water in here? No. I don't know if you can put water in like that. Oh, it's got people. Oh, I am totally core in this place. I mean, I don't think any of these guys are the special crew that you get with this mod. It's in here. Okay. But they are 
people, and people make life more interesting. So let's just slap this on. I don't know. Is there a spot here? We'll put it right next to the pool. Oops. There we are. Now let's make sure we're good on power. 150 out of 80,000. So there's no CPU device. There's a lot of solar. Uh, if we turn power on, turn the signals, lights, and weapons off. And then we go through constructors, get those offline. What are they? Large and small. Turn all of that off. Food processors, fridges. Now we'll leave the fridges on. Turn off the ventilators. They're unnecessary. Okay. What's the power looking like? Solar is at zero, but it's nighttime, right? Yeah. Sweet. Whoa. It's got a lot of fuel tanks, though. I need. I also need to up the People's Promises fuel. Extra fuel container, because I got a lot of it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to probably loot into the bits box, because that way it'll be easy to identify the things that need to come out. I don't need any of that in my inventory. I'm going to loot into the bits box, and then... Uh, we'll come back through and review everything we got. I take it back. Sigma Outpost would be an absolutely terrible place to live. Apparently the structural integrity of entire sections of this thing are... They, they reside on the silliest shit. So this entire section, I want to say I picked up a refrigerator and the whole section collapsed. There was a section over... Over there on that side, that the entirety of this section was dependent upon a chair. So, screw Sigma Outpost. While it is a neat looking place, and the fact that you can take it over fairly easily is pretty cool, uh, it absolutely sucks if you want to, if you're going to be the kind of guy that um, customizes it to fit your own purposes. If you're just going to use it exactly as is, fine. But if you're going to try to customize it for your own purposes, it's going to collapse on you. And who knows? Who knows what? Oh my god, there's two quartermasters here. I missed out on because of that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Well, that was cool and weird. All right, I'm going to let me finish looting here and then we'll get back to it. Okay, so uh, I was going through the console. And I found trapdoor multiple use, which is leads you right here. And if you go down, there is a box with regular, and then there's this box that's called special loot. It's got a rocket launcher, crew, O2 bottle. It's just stuff that's it's a little bit different than normal. So I figured I'd hop on and show it to you. Got a bunch of weird stuff in this inventory box. All right, but pretty cool. I like special loot containers. Okay, that was pretty sweet. So, if we look in here in the bits and bops, we got a bunch of weapons. That Those were mine already. We got some oxygen. Uh, we come down here, we got crew. We got crew. A lot of medical devices, which is going to come in handy. We got two quartermasters, which means... So, oh, oh, you know what? I wonder. Hmm. The quartermasters in my last playthrough only had 64... 64 squares. This doesn't actually say, but it acts as a repository. It drops CPU by 100 and can have 500,000 kilo SUs hooked to it, which is exciting if he can have more than 64 boxes. So I'll have to check. I might have to reload the game to get that kind of functionality, but maybe not. Maybe not. We'll give it a shot. What the? Mysterious residue. Commodity item can be sold and bought. Market price is 55. I feel like there's got to be something else to do with that, because that's not really worth my time. And then we got a receptionist table NPC, which doesn't do anything except 100 CPU down, which I thought it was more than that before. Which means it's not really all that useful, but it's got a market price of 10,000, so that's pretty good. Act as a repository, yeah. The only problem is I'd have to empty out a repository to put that one on. <laughs> well, I'll get to it. 
I'll get to it. Well, this is interesting. This planet has Brotherhood of Far. It, Brotherhood of Far is a faction created by the YouTuber Spange, which if you're watching Imperion Galactic Survival videos, you probably know who that guy is. Now, the light got weird. That's why I put a marker on this. Let's see what this Trade Center's got to got to offer. Oh, God darn it. I tell you what, the light on this planet is so bad. And why is that door? That one doesn't shut. It's super annoying. Uh, let's... Is that a big butt bug? Yeah. We're not going that way, though. These guys have player turrets. Which is cool, I guess. Oh, gravity. Look at all these people walking around. I probably should have figured out where the actual entrance was. Um, there we go. Day zero, zero, two. Oh, never mind. Other fact. Can I not get in? It says it's... A trade center. Well, that was weird. No? Oh. Okay, you just gotta butt up against it. Sweet. Turn the lights off. Too bright in here. Brotherhood of Far Trader. Okay, he trades food. He also trades in food. Seems a tad redundant. He trades in guns, and it looks like he buys them. Okay, I can sell a bunch of crap to him. He also buys health thingies, which I don't know why I would want to buy those. Or sell him my health thingies. I guess maybe if I was a medic, I could just make them. Okay, this guy's got some stuff. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Oh, he'll buy that heavy armor. And he's got all of this stuff. That's kind of nice. Wait, can I buy this stuff? Yeah, I can buy it. Okay. okay, that's good. Um, What is this? Embargo lockers? Who's this guy? He will buy that technical artifact that I have. And he'll buy storage boosts, but... I don't want to sell him my storage boost. Okay. Oh, we're shooting something. Hope it's nothing bad. I don't want to get in a fight with these guys. I don't see anything. Must be critters. There's probably some real critters that have popped up. Hmm. Hmm. Ooh, a container unfriendly with the Brotherhood. Okay, uh, I'm going to sell a bunch of stuff to these guys. And and then we'll look around some more. Okay, all in all, pretty good little area. I got a whole bunch of medical supplies. Where'd it go? I bought a bunch of plants for when I want to get a garden started. All in all, not a bad one. Um, I didn't do a whole lot of trading. Well, I did do a lot of trading, but there was a bunch of stuff that they didn't take, so... That is what it is. But we'll be okay. It'll all be okay. Shut up and sit down.